Hey, what's up guys? All right, in this video, we're gonna be talking about ad targeting um, for your e-commerce brand when it comes to TikTok. This is just a strategy video. I, I'm not gonna be showing you any tools or how to actually target the market. I'm just gonna talk about like the strategy side of things. So if you are looking for, you know, the actual tutorial, you can definitely check any other tutorials on, on, on YouTube. And this is just a strategy video. And this is based on my personal experience working with some of the major brands and how they target their specific customer avatar. Now, first thing first I wanna talk about is like working with major, major brands. Um, the companies that I work with, they spend anywhere from like $1,000 per day all the way up to like twenty, thirty thousand dollars $30,000 a day for one of their product lines. If they have like multiple product lines, you're talking about like $150,000 to $250,000 a day. These brands are worth a couple hundred million dollars. And they they focus on like new product launches. They focus on uh, their existing product line on, of course, on, on the holiday season, the the ads budget goes up all the way up to like 300,000 all the way up to like 500,000 in Black Friday sales, Cyber Monday sales and I I'm ha I handle that type of budget so it's pretty normal for these brands to run those type of ads. So that's the first thing. Now let's talk about like what is your customer target market or like how do you target your specific customer avatar? As I mentioned, like this is a, a video around the strategy side of things, and I do a, I see a lot of brands doing this huge mistake of like targeting pretty much everybody on social media platforms when it comes to like running ads for their e-commerce brand, and that is just like the wrong way of doing that. So, for example, let's say you sell hair dryers. This is just an example. So consider like you are selling hair dryers. Who you're going to target? Are you going to target men? Probably not. Mostly women, but just targeting women is not enough. You have to actually talk about their interest level as well. So if they have like a previous history and TikTok and Facebook is pretty good in figuring it out. Their algorithm is pretty, pretty good when it comes to like figuring out that piece out of like, what is the specific characteristics of a woman? And based on the products that you are promoting, you can actually figure out like, okay, if I target women that are anywhere from the age of 20 all the way up to 40, 45, and I let the uh, TikTok or Instagram do its own, you know, uh, uh, figuring out of like how or who they want to target, it's pretty easy to scale the ads from there. Now, that's the first thing. The second thing I want to talk about is the type of ads that you're creating. I'm gonna use like a life and ad where they're actually focusing mostly on hair dryers and toothbrushes. They just came with their toothbrushes, but um, it's a pretty popular brand when it comes to like uh, their hair dryers. They recently launched their toothbrushes as well, where they're talking about like the benefits of using life and uh, toothbrush and the way these um, these toothbrush moves. Okay, so. The second important thing is like when you run video ads or like any type of ads, make sure you do a good demonstration of your product, not just like showing the product itself, but also using the product and showing like the end result of like how it's going to look like before and after. And it goes same for using any physical product. If you have an apparel brand where you're selling clothes and all type of stuff, you can wear those clothes and, and show people of like how it's going to look like. If you have an edible brand, you can actually show like how the edibles um, are going to be beneficial for the users. As you can see right here, this girl is using uh, the curler uh, diffuser and he, she's using the, the hair dryer to actually, you know, dry those hairs. And you can actually see like the end product of like how she looks like when once all the hairs are dried up. Right, so these type of uh, ads are really, really good and they perform really good when you are talking about your specific customer avatar. So this is it for this video, guys. Hope you like it. If you own a personal brand or an e-commerce brand and you need help on scaling your personal uh, e-commerce brand, be sure to click the link in the description below, schedule a call with me, and I would be happy to help you. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks, bye.